This clip is only a minute long, but this is another necessary watching. This is another, we got to watch this clip, okay? Because this will blow your freaking mind, okay? This guy, this is only a minute long. And this is this guy's not Mormon, by the way. This guy's not Mormon. He's not Mormon. This is like a, I forgot what channel I saved this video clip from, but this guy, you know, you'll see. He basically suggests that those who are against Israel are the ones who are causing the calamities, the natural disasters, like hurricanes, or maybe the Maui wildfires, or whatever. He's got Lego hair. Anyway, let me just, I'll play the clip and let it speak for itself, okay? And where are they firing the rockets from? Gaza. Mm -hmm. In 2005, under the Bush administration, we forced Israel out of the Gaza Strip. Five days later, uh, Hurricane Katrina hit the Gulf Coast. And uh, this book called Eye to Eye by my friend Bill Koenig, he documents 124 instances when there had been historic natural disasters when America was trying to force Israel to give up land. And the most recent was Hurricane Ian. When Hurricane Ian hit Florida, President Biden was giving a speech at the United Nations trying to force Israel into a two-state solution. So does everyone see that? Did everyone see the here the absolute insanity that was suggested in this clip here? This guy basically tied hurricanes to the support of Israel. Get ready for it to be dialed up. Because Donna, old Blormf, old small hands, uh, he's, he's the king of Israel. You better believe it. The guy has, has been, we set up the best anti-Semitism. We set up the best anti-Semitism laws in the world. It's going to be great. We're going to make peace in the Middle East. But anyway, let me just keep playing this. And so this, this is a disaster. So Israel, America must stand with Israel. Mm -hmm. Because when you're standing with Israel, you're standing with God. And that doesn't mean that God doesn't love the Palestinians and all the Arab people because he does. Of course he does, yeah. It just, Israel is... I, I, by the way, I can't help but laugh at that little disclaimer. He's like, God stands with it. And it doesn't mean he hates the, them little Palestinian kids that are being used as human shields. Oh, no, certainly not that. I like... <laughs> I, <laughs> all right, anyway, I'll just... Okay. Special by covenant. Hmm. And the land of Israel is special because it is a covenanted land that God gave to Israel. You know, America has always historically stood with Israel because they're an arsenal of democracy right. in the Middle East. I mean, essentially, they are standing up to... I like how that guy's whispering. He's like, that's right. That's right. He's whispering. That's right. That's right. That's right. All these Muslim like, let's, let's hear that again. I love it. That's right. In the Middle that's right. That's right. That's right. That's right. Stood with Israel because they're an arsenal of democracy right. in the Middle East. I mean, essentially, right. they are standing up to. Oh, let it sunshine.